Hellblade and a little Oxen Free before bed. But before I did that, I figured I'd check out a little bit of this game, which I accidentally, more or less accidentally downloaded. Happy Dungeons. It's a free medium, I think. And um, it's a premium game that's uh, it's new, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Or something. I think it's new. And, uh, um, you know, I'm just going to dive in real quick, see what it's about, and then quit. What the fuck is this game? Happy Dungeons. Quick look. Um, it's not, it doesn't take up all that much space on the hard drive. I guess I don't have to, like, make it a short one. I just, like, at this point, I've played so many freemium games, like, I feel like I, I, I know not to trust them. Uh, a new Happy Dungeons save file will be created. The Happy Dungeons Network service will create and store the save file to the network. Please connect to PlayStation Network when playing the game. Okay. Saving. It's saving. Connect to the PlayStation Network. Thank you for downloading Happy Dungeons. The dev team sent you a gift to your inbox. Gift item, Happy Star times 10,000. Happy card free pass times one. Healing potion times ten. Saving. Yeah. Polishing armor now. It's loading. Removing sword rust now. Okay, good. Now stoking a warrior spirit. Nice, nice. Currently something. I don't know. In the boundless world far, far away. There was a happy war. Yeah, okay. The war took place on islands floating in the sky. There was seemingly no one to the number of people who ended up falling off. Uh oh. Save her! What? Is she gonna kill her? Oh no. Nice! Save her! Oh, that's nice. Go! Uh -oh. Yikes! Aww, he sacrificed himself. Look! Somebody died. Um, okay. Uh, the girl walks around with a little thing. Is the guy gonna fall down? Warriors fall down to this huge island every day. I bet. Who's that? Arg. This is terrible. <sighs> Sorry. Only that one guy. I guess you could sense that he was a good guy. Gob gob, I'm gonna steal everything you got. Okay. Defeat the goblin. Mm, must die. It's a goblin. I know. Oh, I see it, it recharges. Did it. Thank you. This forest is dangerous. Let's get out of here. That's what her voice sounds like. Maybe I won't really like that though, because it sounds really annoying. With the shield equipped. So I don't like overly girly girls. I also don't really like overly masculine men. I think it's part of my problem with the main characters from a lot of video games. Um, I find them boring. Because uh, they're overly masculine, and the, the girl who we ju were just talking to, she's overly feminine, and that bothers me a little bit also. <laughs> Left and right to pan the camera. Okay, got it. Woo! Woo! I'm panning it. Am I not panning it enough? 
feel like I panned the camera enough. See, I know how to pan the camera. I get it, I get it, I get it. Right stick is pan camera. There she is. Wow, it's really, really making me pan the camera a lot. Okay, there we go. We did it. Uh, L2 is dodge roll. Nice. What's this? Is this telling me L2 is dodge roll? Is that what that is? Oh, roll. Press L2 at the same time when you flash blue. Means wait, I didn't manage to finish reading it. Let's see. If I go back up again, will I hear it again? Okay, there. It means you're invincible. Bam. He's not flashing blue though. Oh well. Uh, square and R2 at the same time, and something happens. Uh, okay. Defeat the goblins. The way out is just over there. Will she actually fight? Did she die? Oh, she got hurt. She just stands there. Whatever. Oh, she applauds me as I fight. Um, yeah, this game's pretty sexist. I feel bad, like, like this game's for children, and then it's like, it's totally slightly negative for little girls. They're trying to reinforce, um, you know, traditional, um, values, traditional, um, you know, um, values according to, um, I guess, most societies where it's sort of like, little boys should want to grow up to adventure and little girls should want to be, grow up to be rescued. Save the video clip here. 